This is Josiah Plays Deus Ex Mankind Divided. Okay. Here we are, we're back in Prague, nighttime Prague. And we've just talked to this guy. We've read the newspaper. Right, it's a new newspaper talking about the forensic. Hey, these are different advertisements than the newspaper had the last time. And the reporter was murdered, and that's very unfortunate. We feel bad for her. Haven't we got rid of them yet? You need it, I got it. And there was no reason to go down in the basement because there was nothing called. new down there. We already talked to this guy. Did we talk to them? Prosím, musím dneska nakrmit rodinu. Needs to feed his family tonight. Dej mi pár kreditů. Please, I have nothing to eat. Man, I would give you credits? something, but credits? You have spare credits? I can't take that gun. We're gonna go in here. We're gonna go back over to the other side of town. Get lost, Hanser. Unless you are here to confess to bombing Ruzika. I'm I'm not. You were there. I recognize you from the security footage. Following the cries of orgasmic delight. Gotta love those cries of orgasmic delight. I'll try to resist the urge to randomly blow shit up. Old Town? Best place in Prague to be after dark. Jestli you can get a little bit of everything. I wouldn't wander into some other parts of the city though. Not at night. I am proceeding to go wander into another I'm part of the city. Like, like ASAP. Huh. What's up, civilian? I just want to get drunk, get laid, and get these horrible oh, images of the Rosica explosion out of my mind. I can understand that. In my experience, the best way to solve a problem is to ignore it, or get stinking drunk. That sounds very Eastern European. I've now discovered that I can remote hack these flying drones now, which makes me so fucking happy. Hey drone, guess what? Oh, you're disabled for 30 seconds. How does that feel? Ground mail was a better option. Achievement unlocked. Alright, anyway, we're going down here in the train station so that we can go back over to the other side of town. So cool the way their helmets open Nothing up like that. Suspicious here. Yes, yes, I know. You're an upstanding citizen and don't deserve that kind of treatment. Just have your papers ready. Tell your hands their friends to stop blowing up innocent people. And we'll see what we can do about stopping this chest. Why do you think that everyone who has augmentations is my friend just because I have augmentations? It's not like we all know each other. <laughs> I do not have time for this. Oh, he's got the scrub helmet. He doesn't have the cool opening visor helmet. Back off. I am working. All right. Calm your shit. What's this? I don't care about your credentials, Aug. Follow the rules or we'll make you follow them. The segregation is as much for Aug's safety as it is for the safety of natural. You know, I've noticed the Prague police force has a lot, a lot of women on it. Like, they're at least 50% women. Which seems unusual for a police force. You were all at AugFest 2016? Yeah. Some of these tourists do not respect boundaries. They think if you are a woman and in the red light district, then you can be bought. I would never assume that. I left the last man who tried to get too friendly on the ground. We got us a badass here. You know anyone in Golem City? My sister is in there. God, I hope she is okay. Well, I just spent a lot of time at Golem City and I can tell you your sister is probably not okay because that place is a dystopian hellhole. I've never visited. 
but I've heard horror stories from in there. Seems like it is only getting worse now that Rucker is dead. Yeah, it's really, really bad. You should probably be super worried about your sister. No, just no. <laughs> I have places to be. What's going on here? What? What? Leave me alone. Looks like you picked out a nice comfy spot there, pal. Let me rest. I lost my job after the incident. I used to insure ogs on construction crews. Must be rough. The day after the incident, I thought, good. Now people will be forced to band together and help each other out. Was I ever fucking naive? Yeah, that is not the way it's gonna happen. Alright, let's get out of here. And, um... Go back over to the other side of town so that we can look into this... We can look into this... No. No. The glitch situation. Where this, like, AI computer person thing wants to meet us. This is very intriguing to me. And while we're over there, we'll stop by our apartment and drop some crap off in storage. So we'll go back to Capic Fountain Station. I wonder if there's different people on the train at night than during the day. Or if it's just going to be the same old woman and her kids staring at me all crazy. That woman and her kid ride this train a lot. It's the same old woman and her kid! What are you people doing that you're constantly riding the train? I think these people might live on the train. Every time I get on the train, that woman and her kid are there looking at me all crazy. Adam's way too cool to sit down on a train. That train is nicer than most of the city. I'd live there. Yeah, you got a point. Most of the city is pretty fucked, but then there's like some super fucking fancy apartments sometimes. And Adam's apartment is pretty pretty damn nice considering he lives in the quote unquote poor Hold district. It, Clank. You took the wrong train car. That Motherfucker. Was for Let's see your documents, and you'd better hope they are this all in order. <laughs> impressive credentials. I'm orange level, Not motherfucker. Enough for you to pass as a natural. Don't do it again. Go on. Get this out. guy's always fucking hassle me about riding on the natural car, which I always do. Like they did not see me working here all day. I always ride in the natural car, and they always fucking hassle me. What's going on here? Things are all trashed. Talk, laddie, talk, laddie. Like I am not a citizen Do not here. Trust that fucking oh, this is the woman that's here. recruiting for Rabia. Look, her stuff is all trashed. What happened, Felice? I just came from the Udalek complex, Felice. Golem City. Those people haven't been relocated. They've been detained. And they're running out of supplies, of space, of hope. I told you. We cannot control how the government handles Udalek. I was not even permitted to recruit there. If I did, I'd fill my quota in 30 minutes. Shipping everyone to Rabia doesn't mean things would go differently. Augs are being dehumanized. You don't fix that with eco-friendly architecture. There are two problems with Udale. A construction problem and an ideological one. Mr. Brown learned from past mistakes. And now we have checks and balances in place to screen out the undesirable elements. Checks and balances? What I saw in Gollum City goes deeper than security screening. Really? Then what do you think the problems are? Uh, totalitarian fucking fascist police state, everybody being completely oppressed in a hellish fucking <laughs> dystopian, like, Kafka nightmare that's the main problem i'd say um let's see do i think arc are the problem no i don't think arc are the problem arc are cool well they are a little bit militarized i suppose but they're still cool they're still doing more more good than harm i think militarized police are the problem yeah militarized police are the problem
The real problem is a militarized police force who see the people they're supposed to protect as threats. There's no common ground, no oversight, no accountability. Rabia will be policed by Santo's own security services. They are augmented like us, and since Rabia is a corporate state, they have a vested interest in the city. It is part of the new city vision. Corporate security answers to the corporation. It's in the name. If the new city <laughs> vision starts eating into Santo's bottom line, how long before they're pulled out? Mr. Brown, Santo has invested too much into Rabia for it to fail. It has to succeed. Not just for the augmented, but for the future. I hope it pays off. So it will succeed because it has to. I still see I bad things happening burn. there. It's not like they did not see me working here all day. I mean, of course, I like the idea of rugby. I hope it succeeds, but I just can't see don't it working worry, out in the long run. Like I am not a citizen here. I just came from the Udalek company. Wait a minute. No, we're not going to have this whole conversation again. Apparently, we are. All right. I have a permit. It's not like they did not see me working here all day. We've already been in here. There's nothing new. I guess I could try taking. Oh wait, I'm not taking the train again. I'm already here. Wrong compartment, fuckhead. Hey, fuck yourself. Naturals in the naturals car and the ogs in the ogs car. It's not that difficult to understand. I go where I want. That's not that difficult to understand. Next time, maybe I decide to beat it into your plastic skull. Hmm. You know, I could just... I could just... Nobody's really watching. Police isn't really watching. Naturals only. I'm gonna let you- I'm gonna let you stay conscious, for now. Don't mistake my kindness for weakness, sir. I can zoom in on your face as much as I want. Look at me. Zoom. 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 Anybody in here still? Now they're fucking tick- oh, it's, it's night time. I guess that's why they're- the ticket office is closed. That's actually logical. They have less security here at night as well. What do you want? You have been cleared through this checkpoint. Go! We do not want trouble. There is no need to start any trouble, yes? You don't want trouble from me, that's for damn sure. Look, madam. Your papers state right here that you are currently restricted to the Prikashka district. I'm sorry, but I can't let you through. But I can't get the best oranges in my area. That is why they put this restriction on me, because I like to go to Old Prague for the oranges? I don't understand this. It was not oh, a weapon. It was just a small knife to peel my oranges. Look, it's only a two months restriction. What? I'm sure you can survive without the best oranges for two months. Motherfucker, she just wants oranges. Fucking police state. I could get you some oranges. I'm orange level. I'm literally orange level. I'm the clearance level you need to get oranges. Look at this. I can I can hack the police car's al alarm and turn it off so that I can steal from the police car. Remote hacking. Here we go. No, I fucked it up. Here we go. No, I fucked it up. Here we go. Oh shit. Uh I don't know what happened to that car there. I'm just I'm just over here. Just chilling on the stairs. I certainly had nothing to do with that little situation. Nothing here. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> Homeless gangs and ogs. You people have really helped to ruin this part of the city. R you people, thanks. I'd like to run you all out of town. Hopefully, with that bastard Rucker dead, we can do just that. Well. I'm glad the problem isn't the corrupt ass police force. Oh wait, it is. No activity. These clanks better not bother us today. Let's try this again. Wow, that's actually kind of difficult. There we go. 
Now there's no alarm, they won't notice me uh, randomly. Oh, they didn't even have anything in their trunk. Cut the games. What's up? Look, whatever it is, I cannot help you. I just want to make you open and close your helmet a whole bunch. Just keep moving. No loitering, sir. We need to keep the checkpoint area clear. Either clear the checkpoint area or pass through the things you see. What's up, security drone? Uh oh. Oh shit. Is that drone gonna be angry? No, apparently doesn't even know I tried to hack it. <laughs> What's wrong with your drone there, cops? What's wrong with your drone? It seems to be having problems. Seems to be having problems. We met Edward Broad in, uh, Column City. Now, I could just walk over and turn off the radio, but only noobs walk over and turn off the radio. Cool people turn it off from across the room. Oh my god, remote hacking is the best. Why did I not have this the whole time? Terrible tragedy. How did it happen? Ogs, how else? Same bastards that blew up the police station, the Razika station. Really? They've admitted to it. I, I didn't hear. The pain and terror all those people must have felt. It makes me sick just to think about it. So, it was Arctan. They've taken responsibility. Such an awful thing, this division. I think I'd like to change the subject. This division. Mankind. Divided, one might say. Place sure has changed in nine months. Makes me wish I would have stayed abroad. Život vypadá v katalogu hezky, co? Plno příležitostí a naděje. Ale pak, když ho žiješ, to není hezké ani trošičku. Need to order some soap from the catalog. Mě si nevšímej. A to nejsem ani vopilej. Ne moc. Trouble. Guaranteed. They say absence makes the heart grow fonder, but I don't know. Absence has kind of opened my eyes. I hear you, man. I hear you. Where'd that other guy go? Where'd you sneak off to? I'm sorry, but I don't like to talk to you people. Well, I don't like to... Talk to Please, you, people. Leave me alone. Actually, I do. I love to talk to you, people. Here we go. Car alarm. And boom. No, I fucked it up. Boom. Got it. It's harder than it looks. Oh, shit. Adam, did you check out that apartment on Havani Street yet? I've been no. busy. Don't miss this chance, son. Based on past border control logs, Orlov never stays in Prague for very long. Oh, so maybe it's a timed thing. Holy shit, they have exo exosuit guys out on the street here at, at night, huh? With the column riots threatening to spill over into the city, our trigger fingers are itchy. I see that you have a huge gun built into your arm. I've got no patience for you, Hansers, today. Bombings and riots. No one would blame me if I put a hole in you right now. That's true. She's got a point. What the hell? Oh. Um. 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 <laughs> um. She didn't like that, apparently. Apparently that back of that police vehicle does not have a free take one sign on it. I thought maybe I could just slip that out of there since the alarm was turned off. But 
No. <laughs> the answer is no. You cannot just randomly take one of their gas grenades right in front of Exosuit Lady. She will just gun you down in the street. Just gun you the fuck down in the street. Hashtag just prog things. I'm st Wait, what's happening here? Get away, gun. I have an idea. What if... Hold on. What if I cloak and then do it? Hello? How the fuck? I was invisible. I was literally invisible. I was literally invisible. I guess she saw the door to the back of the car open up. A grenade come floating out of the back of the car. And then suddenly I'm standing there. <laughs> Fine. Fine, I won't steal it. How about that? How about we just not steal it? How does that sound? Are you happy? I hope you're happy. The doors seem to strict. Yeah, yeah, it's the doors, yeah. Kávám tady spoustu dobrých lidí, ale víš, oni jsou naučený myslet určitým způsobem. Vycvičili je, aby krmili stroj. Got us a philosopher here. Většina lidí myslí akorát na sebe. Klidně bys mohl ležet na ulici a krvácet a lidi by tě klidně překračovali. You wanted ice cream, but you don't have ice cream, so you got booze? Nice. The natural replacement for ice cream. Is there a new new episode of Samus Dot? There is a new issue of Samus Dot. Palisade, Centralizing Secrets. By Little K, who apparently writes all their stories. Samus Dot is all about truth and information. Which is why we consider the greatest thing to happen to Prague in the last 15 years to also be the worst. The creation of the Palisade Bank in 2017 created a welcome surge in the economy and put Prague back on the map, improving everyone's quality of life. Or did it? Since then, thousands of companies and their powerful owners have hidden behind those treacherous walls, allowing many to conveniently sidestep normal regulation or transparency in their business practices. And it's not the corporations who apparently pay the highest price for such secrecy. When a Palisade employee recently attempted to steal sensitive data, the aspiring thief was efficiently terminated by the bank's alarmingly lethal security systems. Proud parents of the Palisade, Tawar and Oshiro, presented this as an unfortunate but reassuring example of why their clients can consider their private data safe. Whether true or just another corporate cover-up, the fact that a human employee was in a position to compromise the world's most secure data bank must worry those invested interests. For, for now, one thing's painfully clear. If you decide to keep your secrets inside the Palisade Bank, don't forget your password. I've already stolen a bunch of stuff from the Palisade Bank. There's truth in there locked up behind the, the bars of the bank. Ooh, uh, an article about Eliza. Let's see what they know about her. They probably don't know the real truth about Eliza. Eliza Kassan, who is the real face of Picus? Everybody knows Eliza Kassan, making bad news look good for years. The mouthpiece of those moguls of misinformation at Picus is a valuable commodity to the world's biggest media circus and one of the most famous people on the planet. So it seems strange that we know so little about her off camera. After the AUG incident, Kassan suffered a mysterious breakdown and disappeared from public view, so abruptly that it even led to speculation of her death. See? Okay, hold on. That's what I've been saying. I don't think this is the real Eliza that we actually knew from the end of the first game. I think she, like, went rogue or, or was destroyed or shut down or had to go dark into the internet or something, and the real El and and. This Eliza that's on TV now is like a new reprogrammed version that is, that is doing the will of the corporate masters again because the old Eliza wasn't really getting with the program. 
That's what I think. I think I think this isn't the real Eliza that's on TV now. Or at least the original one, I mean. She later returned with no official statement, but something's felt off since then. Did she die in 2027? Is Picus's popular puppet merely a coach look-alike? Maybe we don't know Eliza like we thought we did. And there's a strangely altered picture of Eliza. And maybe that's who's this thing, this strange entity that was glitched inside the advertisement board that wants to meet with us. Maybe that's the original Eliza trying to reach out. That would be really cool. And it would also make me feel good because it would mean that I've been right since the beginning of the game in my whole theory about what's going on with Eliza. Hide your magnets. We've got a metal Got a place to stay, Clank? I'd get back there if I were you. I do actually have a very nice apartment, thank you. Stay out here and we'll find you face down in the gutter. Come down. No big loss. I doubt, I doubt that's the case. I doubt that's the case. Unless I accidentally try to take something from a police car and they get mad at me. I don't know what that means. I look cool as fuck. What are you talking about? Alright, hold on. You don't care about this car, right? I can't believe it. After all the progress we've made with the naturals, defacing so much meaning with so much hatred. The movement will survive this, you'll see. This is the very essence of Per Aspera et Astra. I don't know. The neighborhood is changing. The old fear is creeping back into its bones. Now this cruentus business? That means soaked in blood. Jesus, that's a threat! It's probably just kids. And even if it's not, it's like I said. I know, I know. A rough road leads to the stars. I just... I'm scared. So, sounds like things are getting worse. The enemies of peace are ignorant. Defacing our mantra will only bolster the movement. Yeah. I had so much hope that us and the naturals were making progress. Thing, well, now that Talos Rucker has been mysteriously killed, I think that has set the progress back considerably. I hope I'm around to see the day that we live in peace again. That's gonna be never, probably. I'm sorry, but I don't like to talk to you. Then why are you all up in my shit, son? Okay, what about this over here? This looks like something they don't care if I... There's nothing in there. Church of the Machine Gods over there. What's up? What's up with you folks? Nerosamin. Leave me alone. She doesn't seem okay. Can I can I assist you in some way? You will be fine, I promise. <laughs> Do not give up hope. I don't think I can assist her. Can I help myself to the contents of this car? There's only so much we can do right now. I wish it were more. Shit. Alright, nobody's gonna notice. Nothing to see here. Oh, uh, there's not even anything in there. My teeth are falling out. You alright? I don't understand. It was just a small knife for peeling my oranges. She just wants some oranges, man! Now I have to wait for two months to get the best oranges. This is not living. This is prison. Yeah, I hear you. If I couldn't get the best oranges, I'd be fucking pissed. I would. Alright, I'm heading back toward my apartment. Ooh, another new newspaper. Pikus Daily Standard. This is the second new Pikus Daily Standard we've found since we came back to town. Palisade Bank expands beyond Prague. The Palisade Bank Corporation has unveiled plans to expand its holdings in the Czech Republic. We will be doubling the number of technical and administrative jobs locally, said Palisade CEO Ashani Tawar. We've broken into her office. While building new data storage facilities in four cities. Ostravea, Olomouc, Zlin, and Kladno are expected to top the list. Headquartered in Prague, the Palisade Bank Corporation is the largest and most prestigious 
secure corporate archiving company in the world. Catering to mega corporations and the wealthy, it uses cutting edge physical and digital security measures, including next generation firewalls, state of the art encryption, proprietary biometric password encoding, and more. This will be the bank's first major expansion since the AUG incident, the second since 2025 when automated defenses inside a storage facility killed an engineer. Her death drew international attention until it was proven she'd been died trying to access a client's accounts. Yeah, proven my ass. Until it was covered up with some bullshit story, probably. Uh, Alright, so then what's this other one? Versalife CEO, Bob Page. The infamous Bob Page. Villain of future slash past deus ex. Versalife CEO unfazed by declining stocks. Versalife stocks, already down 6% from last quarter, continued to perform poorly as investors took note of declining neuropazine sales. CEO Bob Page assured stockholders not to worry, though, since cutting-edge research into infectious diseases and genome-based cures should turn a profit very soon. Oh yeah, so they're working on fucking secret biological weapons that they're going to unleash on the populace and then have to sell everybody the cure. That's what's happening next. They're, that's, that's their new plan. Calling it now. Oh, is this? Once upon a time, I could have shoved newspapers under my clothes. Another reason to hate technology. <laughs> oh shit! We just read about this in the paper. This is where that journalist was murdered, apparently. Right outside our apartment building. Someone is targeting Augs. This one is not the first. You should be careful. You could be next. She's just lying. They should at least cover her up. Yeah, they should. Go see for yourself. I will. But I want to see what's going on in Teresa's place first. <laughs> A co jiného mám dělat? Vožírat se každou noc, dokud už mi nezbyde na úplatky fízů. All these people Vlastně weren't here before. Skončí, a my budeme svobodní. Na zdraví. Takhle to nefunguje. Could I get Svět some subtitles? I don't know what these people are saying. To samý skorumpovaný město. Však ty se vrátíš. Ej, Tohle město má sice svoje problémy. Wow. Ale já si nedovedu představit, že bych žila někde jinde. You did invite me to fuck off, though. Na tohle jsem čekal celý den. I hope you guys are having a nice conversation. This is not my pivo, camarade. Wow! Join us for a beer, friend, is like the friendliest thing anybody said to us in ages. Cherishek stal za hovno, dnešek stojí za hovno. Aspoň zejtra to snad bude lepší. Good point. Odchod z Prahy není žádný důvod k Moslavě. Je to můj domov. Ale už tady prostě nevydržím. Náš druh tady není vítaný. Hmm. Oh, he's an Og. Yeah, Look, he's got a cyber hand. Jo, jasně, že máš pravdu. Yay, Ogs. Ještě jedno. I always say that. Pivo prosím. Yeah, I say that too, all the time. I wonder if... Alright, we've read that. I wonder if uh, Teresa's downstairs. Oh, there's... See, there was nobody down here before, and there, there she is. So now she's running her nighttime underground bar place, which was completely empty when we came in here before. I've read this, I think. Yeah, I've read it. What do you want? I'm not carrying, pal. Besides, you need new paws, right? Isn't my thing. I have shit totens of neuropazine already, thanks though. Move it! You trying to get me grabbed by the cops? Get out of here. I hear that soon enough you will need a solicitation license. And our earnings will be taxed. Well, earnings being taxed is nothing new. Even though prostitution is illegal, the city's bureaucracy has to make sure they get a slice of the profits. Wait, they're gonna tax prostitution and keep it illegal? How does that fucking work? No, to je mi pěkný. Plechovka. 
Myslím, že byste se měla radši někde schovat, vy plecháči. Tady lidi nejsou tak slušní jako na starém městě. Dokonce prej pár plecháčů přišlo o součástky, když se nedívali. Ahoj. What's up, Teresa? Do you need What some more norafazine? Because I still kind of feel bad about breaking into your apartment and stealing your... I never realized before, she's a fucking og. Interesting. I just caused some sort of crazy shit to happen with your boxes there as well. Sorry. What can I get you? Beer? Something else? I don't need beer. What else have you got? Oh, just an item of interest. For someone who lives off of their sales, you're unusually reserved. Well, sometimes it's hard to know who to trust, especially these days. For example, I don't suppose you have any neuropozine you would be willing to spare, do you? Actually, yes. I have this bottle of neuropozine that I stole from your safe in your apartment. Here you go. Sure. Here you go. Thank you. I can't tell you how much this means. These are tough times. We all have to do what we can. You understand? That's... You have no idea how many people just look the other way. But we can't afford to. Not Augs. And not anyone else. What happens to one happens to all of us. The neuropazine isn't even for you, is it? <laughs> no, it's not. I'm what you might call a... Well, I think of myself as a Samaritan smuggler. I get things for people in need. I'm glad I could help. Listen, I can't let you leave without thanking you properly. I store a few supplies in the basement. The code to the door is 1015. Help yourself to what's down there. I'm already in the basement. Thanks. Don't mention it. Like you said, we all need to help each other. Now, is there anything else I can do for you? Let's see those odds and ends you have for sale. Uh, I don't need a first aid pack, thank you. Don't mention it, it was yours anyway, says Nice, but yeah, exactly. I'm good for now. As you wish. Okay, well... This is probably the same... Oh, shit, sorry. Yeah, it's the same, alright. I don't think she has anything new in her little hidden storage area here. We've already pretty much looted the shit out of this. What is that? Sorry, sorry if I'm trashing your closet a little bit. Sorry. 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 But, look at this. That didn't do anything. I mean, I know there's a secret door here, but I didn't... What does that button do? We've already been through here. It leads down into, the, like, the sewers and shit. Alright. Let's go. You looking at something? So can I even get through here? Well, that is interesting. Oh, <laughs> yeah. I can just knock those police line do not cross tapes right the fuck out of my way. Hi, cops. Don't be alarmed. Ah, I sense a side quest. Look at this fucking investigator. You can't let them get away with it. Have to tell us. She won't talk to the police. I give up. Is this... Oh, Daria... This is the cat lady! What the hell is the cat lady doing here? We also broke into her apartment and we saw all of her cat-related paraphernalia. This woman loves cats. If it wasn't for Johnny, I might have paid you for this. Who the fuck is Johnny? Give it a rest. Who the fuck is Johnny? Get out of my way. I'm examining this. Fuck walking this beat. 
If oh, look her by the coffee. arm has been ripped off. She was she had an augmented arm. Oh, she must have had augmented legs as well, and they were also ripped off. Wow, that's brutal. <laughs> we can't let them right get away with this. I'm not Montag. I don't need your help. I don't know who Montag is. We'll play some more no, but she was. And she had enemies. Stuck down I hear there's been a series mm. of these. Tabloids write that shit to sell copies. No, this was political. It's always political. It's got a point. Gruesome, isn't it? Yeah, it's horrible. I can't look away. It was just a matter of time before they got her. Before who got her? She's that journalist. The one writing all those things about... You know who? You'll have to fill me in. Radko Maximilian Perry? The local anti alg politician? That guy! That's Angela Gunn lying there. She's the one that's been writing about him. There was a threat of a scandal and everything. Coincidence? Yeah, that Perry seemed really suspicious to me, and he's also a big time AUG hater. Um, can't just accuse people left and right. We're gonna go with Spur here. Sounds like someone should go after this guy. Ask him some questions. That's exactly what I'm saying. Just... If you do that, please don't mention me. I don't want to end up like her. What else can you tell me about Radko? The guy's a sleazy piece of shit. That's all there is to it. And you think he's capable of murder? Absolutely. Did you actually see anything? I just got here. So I see what you see. A dead, augmented journalist. Thanks. Yeah, I've broken into Radko Perry's... Uh, his guy's called Scandalmonger. He looks like he's one of the cult of the Machine God guys. I... Yeah, I've already broken into his apartment and rooted through his shit, so he does seem like a scumbag. This is some sick shit right there. Who politics. This it's baby. always about politics. Uh -huh. I'm so mad I could just throw a bucket. Ah! Watch out, everybody. Flying bucket coming through. <laughs> Heads up. You think I don't know what's going on? Alright, let's, let's, let's talk to Cat. Let's talk to Cat Lady. She must have been her friend or something. She lives in my building. Fuck walking this lady. I recognize you. We're neighbors. I've seen you in our building. You're very difficult to miss. By chance, did someone send you to investigate? No, no one sent me. What happened here? It's horrible. An augmented woman was killed. Just outside of where we live. She looks like she was my age. Oh, she didn't know her. It's so sad that nothing will be done about this. Org victims are not high on the list of police priorities. To them, it's like a dog lying in the street. You... you're not a cop, by you? Ish. This woman acts like, oh, I've noticed you around. She hasn't just noticed us around. Let's keep in mind also that this woman has a telescope in her fucking apartment that is pointed directly at my apartment. So she's been watching Adam. She's been spying on him. Maybe she's got a crush on him. Maybe she has more sinister intentions. I don't know. But she's not telling us everything. So anyway, cat lady. Uh, We'll go with... We'll go with no, I'm not. I work with someone else. Another agency. That's perfect. You outrank the police? Depends who you ask. The detective here. He, he's not willing. I got the feeling he doesn't care. What about you? What's your interest in all this? Morbid curiosity? God, no. I want nothing more than to go home. Detective Montag, he's making me stay. He... He thinks I saw something. Did you see something? Maybe. I think I would rather not say, to be honest. Because if I had seen something, and if I started talking about it, wouldn't that put me in danger? Hmm, I don't trust her. I don't trust her. Maybe she's involved in this. I should watch her too, Jan, that's right. 
Uh, may already be in ditch. <laughs> Let's just tell her the scariest shit possible. The killer is definitely coming for you, lady. Um, let's be sympathetic. It's natural to be scared. Then you understand. I don't want to get involved if I don't have to. Sure, I understand. You don't know anyone here. But there's a chance this could happen again. The more you're willing to cooperate with the police, the better the odds of catching whoever's responsible. I know. It's just that I don't trust the police. Or should you? I would feel safer with someone like you. You have more reason to be invested in this than they do. You're augmented, like the victim was. And you look like you could actually protect me. It's not my case. Okay, slow your roll, but lady. maybe you could help. Please, neighbor. Talk to Detective Montag. At least see how it's going. Make sure he doesn't think he's on vacation just because the victim is an orc. Oh, we got us a side mission. Yeah, I'll, I'll jump on this. Don't even trip. I'll talk to the officer in charge and see where he is with the investigation. If I can help him, I will. Thank you. Suppose I end up remembering something later. Is there a way for me to contact you? You planning to run off on me? She's trying to get my digits. The first chance I get. There are times for standing in the cold, but this isn't one of them. I just want to go home, bolt the door, and never come out again. Of course, I will wait for Detective Montag to say it's okay first. And I'll still try to answer whatever questions you may have. I can give you access to my info link. You should feel free to use it if you have to. Thank you, neighbor. Oh, she flirting hard. Talk to you about what happened. How come she talks to him and not to me? <laughs> Ooh. The Harvester. So there was a gang called the Harvesters in the first game in uh, Hangsha that used to kill people and take their cybernetic augs and resell them. So this may have something to do with a similar sort of situation, but I don't think so. I think we're being misled there. I don't think it has anything to do with that. Although the person did take her cybernetic augs, her arm, her arm and her legs, so maybe there is some element of that going on. Talk to Montag. A local cop named Montag is in charge of the crime scene. Daria doesn't have much faith in his ability to catch the killer and keep her safe. I told her I'd look into it. Mission briefing. A murdered woman lies in the street. A potential witness, Daria, the cat lady, is worried she saw something she wasn't supposed to. The victim was augmented and Daria says that's enough to keep the people around here from investigating any further. Alright. Something is going to push them into attacking us. I have some questions for you. I will cooperate. You have promised to help, and so I will try to help as well. Well, see, I can, I can straight up grill her now. All right, I'll play devil's advocate and ask this. I mean, obviously, why don't you trust the police? Because all the police in this fucking city are corrupt as shit. But I'll ask her anyway. Why is it you don't trust the police to take care of this case? I have bad memories of the police. What kind of memories? Get calls I didn't want. Tickets I didn't deserve. The policemen here are, are worse than children. Former captains of high school sports teams will never recapture their years of glory. I was captain of the debate team in high school. <laughs> what? Seriously? Yes, well, debate is different. <laughs> I wonder if Adam is just saying that, or if he really was the captain of the debate team. That's pretty fucking funny. He doesn't seem like the type. Um... What were you doing here besides creeping around being a strange cat lady? Stalker. What were you doing here? I was looking for Starlight. My cat. Of course you there were. There was lightning and suddenly this flash of certainty. That's when I knew something awful was happening. Where were you exactly? In the shadows. My head was down. I couldn't move. Oh god, stupid Daria. I shouldn't have gone out today. The energies were all wrong. No, oh, the energies. Gotta watch out for those energies. Is there anything else I should know about you? You want to know about Daria? What is there to tell? Small town girl came to the big city to escape her problems. To try and become someone else. Did it work? 
Not really. You can't escape yourself. You can't just come to a big city and expect all your problems to seem smaller. It doesn't work that way. I'm not sure if I buy this whole persona that she's putting on here, but maybe it's legit. I mean, her apartment certainly seems to sell the idea that she's actually just a socially awkward, sort of introverted, cat-obsessed, creeper kind of person who's just scared and innocent. But, uh, I don't know. She may have something more sinister going on. DT Pandemonium 1, how you doing? Good to see ya. All right, tell me about this murder. How did the attack happen? What was the killer doing? He was on top of her, cutting the evil out. That's what he called it. Uh, I mean, I think. You think? So you heard his voice? Very clearly, yes. He sounded confident, authoritarian, like a general commanding troops. What did he say exactly? It is time to make you whole again. Ooh. We got us a crazy. Uh, DT Pandemonium. Yeah, I think this game is really good. I, uh, I really enjoy it. I've been enjoying the heck out of it. I really liked Deus Ex Human Revolution, and I really like this one, so... I guess it just depends on what kind of games you like. Nox says, ask if she has any leads on the missing milk. I know, right? Everywhere we go, there's cereal. Shitloads of cereal, but no one has milk. What is going on here? Dun-dun-dun! Uh, maybe in Eastern Europe they can't afford to have milk with their cereal, so they just eat dry cereal. I don't know. Maybe they just put water on their cereal. I don't know what they do, but there's no milk. All right, what does this killer look like? Can you remember anything about what the killer looks like? To be honest, I saw more of the shadow than the man. I remember he was very big. The shadow, it covered everything. So you can't describe him? Not the face, no. His clothes, he was wearing something very dark, uh, black, maybe blue. Was he augmented? He moved like an augmented man, but I can't say for sure. What the fuck does that mean? So he was very big and dressed in dark. That does not narrow it down. Alright, what do you know about this detective guy? What's your take on Montag? You ever meet him before tonight? I went to the station once, years ago complain about the ticket. Detective Montag is the one they send you to handle the paperwork. How'd he do? He did fine. The point is, he's a desk jockey. Look at him, he's lost out here. The cops who know how to catch killers, they're not the ones sent to investigate murdered ox. I see, so he's not a real detective. He's like their scrub detective that they use for shit they don't care about. Alright, that's good to know, actually. Alright. Uh, well, I'll look into this. You just continue watching me through your creepy telescope and playing with all your cat-related things. I'm gonna do what I can to help the investigation. Good luck. Alright. So we're gonna go in here and we're gonna- we're gonna talk to this detective in a second and investigate this grisly, grisly murder that has taken place. But... That's going to happen in our next episode, because that's going to do it for this one. So thank you for watching. This has been Josiah Plays Deus Ex, Mankind Divided.